back to the channel so first of all just simply log in with your credentials and once you're done with this just simply come back over here now just simply search for the vm instance open this thing in new tab come back over here wait for a second now now just simply click on this accessory button now it will take a couple of seconds to establish connection meanwhile in the description box of this video i will share one github link just simply click on that link and then you are able to access this document now what you have to do here you can see we have to run this command on the first connection so just simply copy command like this way come back over here click on this authorize now just simply wait Now just simply paste and hit enter. Now just simply wait for a couple of more minutes. And here you can see sleeping 5.0 second when you start seeing this kind of output now what you do click on this gear icon and then click on this new connection like this way now again just simply come back over here now just simply copy this command like this way and make sure that it's already mentioned like we have to run this command on the second connection so just simply copy like this click on this connection just simply wait and then click on authorize Now just simply paste the command and just simply hit enter. And here you can see build is success. Now if you just simply come back to the lab instructions and click on the check my progress for all the tasks, you will get a score without any issue. And if the score is not updated, no need to worry because lab take time to update the score. Now if I just simply come back over here, click on the task number 2 and if I just simply scroll up and click on this check my progress, I will get a green tick for sure. Now if I just simply scroll down and click on this check my progress, I will get a green tick for sure. Now for the task number 3, it will take a couple of seconds or you can say minute like 5 to 10 minutes to update the score. So no need to worry about that thing. And as you can see, after clicking on check my progress for multiple times, I got a score. And that's the way we have to complete this lab. If you still have any doubts, please do let me know in the comment section. Thanks for watching and have a good day guys.